thing, I actually flow charted a real argument my wife and I had. <laughs> Uh, I was hanging my son's mobile of all the planets in his room, right? So I, I hung the sun, and then uh, Mercury, and Venus, and the Earth, and Mars, and I went to hang Pluto, because it was in the box, and I went, oh wait, Pluto's not a planet, I'm not going to hang it. And my wife said, what are you talking about, Pluto's a planet? I go, no, it's actually, it's been downgraded, it's a dwarf planet, so I'm not going to hang it. She goes, it's a planet, you've got to hang it. Uh, that's where the argument started. Watch where it goes. It's stunning. She says Pluto is a planet. I say no, it's not. She says, are you saying I'm dumb? <laughs> that is what we call a trap. Because <laughs> if I say yes, that leads to divorce. <laughs> so I'm not dumb. I say no. She goes, well, I don't like the way you argue. You're basically using science and, and math and uh, logic, and you are saying I'm dumb. Again, if I say yes, that leads to divorce. So I say no. She goes, well, you don't respect me. You don't care about my feelings. This is a trap in the other direction. <laughs> Because if I say, no, I don't care about your feelings, that leads to divorce. So I say, yes, of course I care about your feelings. She says, well, do you ever want to have sex again? And well, uh, frankly, uh, that's not really an option for me. So in our house, Pluto is officially a planet. In fact, it is my favorite planet. And I redid the mobile. All the other planets now revolve around Pluto. It is the center of my universe.